For any of you people like me and your iPod video, your five year old iPod video lasts about ten minutes on battery because it's annoying and I'm going to show you how to open one to change the battery yourself. Basically, you're going to need a knife. Now, usually these are a pain to get into and it takes a lot more effort than I'm going to show you. But in this case, all you do is you pry the knife into the little slot, the little sandwich part there, and I'll show you that part now. Put like that into there and push backwards. As you can see, the iPod is now basically open. Now, when you open it, be very careful. There are two cables connecting the battery and the headphone jack and slash hold switch. So first, pull the battery down like that and lift it up like so. Now you have access to the hard drive, the battery or the headphone jack. If you want to replace these, you can go ahead and do this now. Now, for example, if you want to get the to replace the headphone jack, lift the hard drive up like that. And now, unclip the ribbons attaching the component you want to replace. In this case, all I'm replacing is the battery. Now, I'm not replacing the battery in this video, okay? I'm just giving you a brief tutorial on how to do it. I've done this already. But, all you do, I'll remove the battery for the sake of video anyway. You simply get a flat blade screwdriver or positive drive in my case and weight the connector upwards and pull the battery out see that's the battery now you put your, get your replacement battery and pull that in and my iPhone's going off obviously I've got a text Meh. then simply realign it back into place like so push it down job done headphone jack same thing unclip the ribbon put the new one in Clip the thing down, job done, put it back together. Okay, in my case everything's done. Now this, you won't have to do. In my case I have to because I'm a cheapskate. This case isn't, this casing doesn't quite fit with me to your hard drive. So, I have to put that in place to make it fit better. But that's it, push the upper back together. Turn it on. reason that foam is a repeat this casing focus camera jesus christ it's supposed to be a good camera obviously not but yeah anyway 60 gig okay ipods always take ages to start up when you chip when they flat or root battery okay And four gig. And yeah, that's basically how to take apart your iPod and perform repairs such as replacing the battery or replacing your headphone jack or hard drive. It's up to you what part you're going to replace. And that's it, really. Thanks.